You're watching Fishing the Flats with host Henry Waschuk. This week's adventure takes us to Mexico's Pacific coast to a place called Punta Mita. This area is surrounded by water on three sides by the Pacific Ocean and is less than an hour from the airport in Puerto Vallarta. There is a mix of everything here, a quaint fishing village, the incredible Four Seasons Resort, and Punta Mita Expeditions, which offers diving, snorkeling, spear fishing, and of course, fishing for the big one with rod and reel, just like this. Pretty simple rig, just a white bait, a little bit of a weight, and just an easy cast just behind the boat. And those fish are all around us right now. They're getting a little bit of pressure because a couple other boats have moved in, but <laughs> you know, that's what happens when they see rods being bent. Come on, baby, here you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby, come on. Oh, yeah, Sebastian, this one feels a little bit better. All right, baby, let me see you. Oh, you're looking at that shoreline just past me. You see that shoreline? That's where the Four Seasons is. That's how close we are. Oh, my goodness. Ah, uh, yeah. Let me get him up. It's like a pompano, you know, it's good, yeah. African pompano, they're really cool looking too. Yeah, all right. Okay. All right, good job. Okay, got him. There's a nice African pompano. They got that big fin up the top, similar to a rooster fish, but only a single. Look at the look at the belly. It's got some nice sheen to it. Just a beautiful fish. Flip them over and give you a nice look at this fish, and they're great eating too. Fish Eye, brought to you by Power Pole Total Boat Control. The African pompano is pelagic and normally solitary, but there are times that these hard-fighting fish school up on the sandbars. In Mexico, these fish can be found from the tip of the Baja California Peninsula, south to Cabo San Lucas, and around all of the Oceanic Islands. The African pompano are found in the water column over sandy bottoms adjacent to rocky structure and can be caught in abundance with the right presentation. Some fish have been reported to reach a length of four feet, but are normally in the 18 to 24 inch range. And if you like eating fish, the African pompano are excellent table fare. The most noticeable trait is the filaments that extend from the dorsal and anal fins. These filaments can be up to four times the size of the entire body on the young, but they tend to disappear as the fish gets older. Regardless of age, they are shiny and silvery, and they can have dark blotches on some parts of their body. One thing for sure, there's nothing like catching these fish on light tackle. There's the bait just out to the left of us there. And all I want to do is just let this work down. I got a live bait on this one. My other rod on my carrot stick, I got a jig. Okay, I got a bite. I got a bite. Oh, they're, they're coming up too. You can see right behind me, there's more. This is a whole school of pump funnel. Come on, baby. Got a bite, got a bite. All right. Yeah, oh, big head shakes on these. Oh, you can see from the rod tip. That's great action. Oh. <laughs> Pompano. There you go. Beautiful. The two big fins, you got one at the very top, one at the bottom. They almost look like giant angel fish. All right, good job. Let's see, got him. Excellent. You know, this is what I was talking about, the two fins. You know, if I put it over the water, you can see that. And they're just so neat. Soft mouth, almost like a permit mouth. Fantastic fish to have. You know, let this one go. There, gone. Coming up, 
some more Silver Beauties. The, all the fins are just gorgeous. Like, see the way on a profile how they open up?